and Kachana Jekma. He is a gulfi or gulfi ice cream is what we are going to see today. Lovely, yummy ice cream, and when the heat is just slowly coming in, someone is speaking up hot. Let's have this lovely kulfi ice cream. We are, see, we are taking steps to see that your kulfi uh, ice cream is very creamy and it has got the right texture. And though the milk, some milks are uh, really not uh, of uh, good consistency, to alter that, we are going to follow some steps and we are going to have a lovely, yummy, creamy. Kulfi ice cream. 1 litre of full cream or full fat milk, 150 grams of sugar, 3 tablespoons of condensed milk, few badam or almond coarsely ground, few pistachios coarsely ground, 100 grams of fresh cream, 1 teaspoon of cardamom powder, 1 teaspoon of corn flour, 2 teaspoons of milk powder, half spoon of saffron. Take a nice large pan like this, pour some little water and keep it on the stove. Now pour this milk. We are adding water to prevent the base of this vessel getting settled with the milk particles. So that's why we are doing this in all of our videos we have been telling about this when we are doing the milk dish. So here also I would just wish to share this with you. Keep stirring this now and then and let it reduce nicely. Allow it to boil first. Now look at the milk. It has reduced nicely, nearly half. So we are going to add the saffron. So now we have added the saffron. And look at this. Slowly as they are just boiling, what will happen? The color will become light creamish yellow. And uh, this is supposed to be giving a good flavor and uh, it's also considered to be good to, good for our health. That's why we have started adding uh, this into all of our dishes. Well, if this saffron is not available or you have to really go far off to buy the saffron, no worries. As usual, you can add the cardamom and then add a pinch of turmeric powder so that you will get the desired color of this. Now we are going to add the almond oil badam crushed almond or badam see what will happen is this will also increase the thickness of this milk so that's why we are adding it before adding the sugar now just have a look at this this has thickened nicely now you can add the pistachios now just add this milk powder I'm mixing it with just one spoon of water just to avoid any lump formation we are just making it as a cream and then we will add it this is not at all required actually if you get the full fat or nice thick milk but uh, that quality of the milk is not guaranteed nowadays so what we are doing is to ensure that you get a nice creamy consistency and you get a nice milk taste in your kulfi we have to add this milk powder mix this well now all the Badam and pistachios are cooked. We are going to add the sugar. Once the sugar is dissolved well, we can add the condensed milk. Well, at this stage, you can taste and see if the sugar quantity is enough. If it is, if you feel it's little more, you can reduce it, and if you feel it is little less, you can add one or two spoons of sugar. But add the condensed milk because condensed milk will improve the consistency and the texture of the gulfi. Now see, again there is a change in texture. Now add the corn flour. This is just one spoon of corn flour to alter the texture of the milk. And it also acts as a nice binding agent and it will improve the texture. So that's why we are adding this corn flour. Never add the corn flour directly to the boiling dish, it will uh, become form lumps. So always mix it well and then add it to your dish. So we have a beautiful lovely texture of this ice cream. Now lastly we will add the 
cream if you're not adding any of these what will happen is the texture of the ice cream your gulfi will be like you're biting some ice so that's why we are adding this to give a better texture to the gulfi now look at this this is the lovely consistency now let's add the cream and switch it off now lastly add the fresh cream the cardamom powder give a nice mix and just have it on the stove for one or two minutes in low heat and then remove it and allow it to cool after adding the cream it need not boil for long time now it's two minutes and look at the consistency now we are going to remove it from the stove and allow it to cool wow just have a look at this this is the consistency they have thickened so well and they have cooled down completely now we are going to pour it to the gulfi molds and freeze them now just cover it up and we are going to freeze it for 8 to 10 hours depending on the freezing time of your refrigerators this will become thick and solid ice cream ice stage so we're going to leave it into the freezer section of the refrigerator so now dear friends after eight hours our kulfi has set well we're going to remove it and see how it has come now to remove this you can just put them into water so that what will happen is this area they will there will be a change in temperature and then you will be able to remove them easily now look at our gulfis So dear friends, hope you enjoyed this session of making this lovely cookies. They are really yummy, you know, and uh, for this approaching summer, we have the wonderful. It's also healthy because we have put all the possible the badam, almond and uh, pistachios. So do this lovely ice cream and keep us posted. Those are the pizza always enhancing your taste buds. If you like this video, press like. Subscribe to Those at Pizza for your printable recipes. Visit thosatpizza.com. Thank you.